at least some bright side here, sunshine today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll we take will, that. We will take. <laughs> right. Even In though we're still week. bracing for, we know <laughs> what's know. ahead on over the weekend, okay. but it's okay. We have such attuned weather PTSD here. It's <laughs> yeah. like, I know that this isn't just what it is. I know this isn't just going to be easy. Some magnolia flowers blooming outside right now. Oh, yeah. Some trees are starting to get there. My hydrangea bushes in my front are starting right. to bloom. And I'm like, you're not going to like Saturday. <laughs> you guys aren't going to be happy about this. Yeah, we are still looking at a chance for snowfall to start the weekend. Snowfall to start the weekend. But we're going to be in the 60s tomorrow, so it is going to be a rude snap of winter like conditions as we head towards the weekend. Not today, not the next couple days. The next few days are going to get more and more spring like before winter surges back in and flexes its muscles. So enjoy the sunshine. Enjoy being outside when the air doesn't hurt your face. That is the simplest way I can say this. Temperatures right now across the area are in the 50s in most locations. It's fairly benign. Like I said, clouds have been clearing through the afternoon. We expect that trend to continue. So we're looking at more sunshine over the next couple days. This is where we're sitting right now. 53 here in Nashville. That wind does have a little bit of nibble to it, but it's not anything that's too strong. Here's a look at what we've got over the next five days. Temperatures climbing through Friday, and that is not a typo. We dip down hard and fast as we head towards the start of the weekend because a bitter cold Arctic air mass is going to push into our area. Again, that's three days away, so you've got sunshine to enjoy in the in between. Clouds have been dancing across our southern and eastern tier, but they are on their way out as well. It'll be a pretty easy night for us. We've got 40s and 50s across the area as we head towards the weekend. Like I said, we're going to be pretty mild the next couple days, but don't let that lure, lure you into a false sense of calm. That Arctic air mass is going to come in and it is potent enough that it does look like we will have a period of all snow late Friday night through Saturday morning. And if you're thinking, well, the ground's got to be relatively warm. We've had some warm snaps. It was 80 last weekend. You're right. It is relatively warm. So initially the snow won't stick, but since most of it's going to happen overnight, as temperatures come down into the 20s, some of this will stick. And we are looking at the potential for accumulating snowfall by Saturday morning. I told my kids that today. My eight year old said, no, it's not. So time to hear you're hearing it from the horse's mouth. We are looking at a sticking snow. This is an early look at the totals that are possible as we head towards Saturday. We'll talk more about this in detail coming up at five and six. Just be ready. I hope you didn't put your winter gear away just yet. You do only need it briefly. Saturday will be raw and cold and Sunday morning we wake up in the teens, but we also spring our clocks forward, which means more afternoon daylight hours as we head towards next week. We're back into the 60s with this slap of winter, just a rude memory. Rory?